have waited a week more to throw those mufflers and woolen socks away. It's time to stash away all the woolen wear and take out that stuff from your wardrobe that's breezy and colourful. Spring means flowers and fragrances, bright and pastel. Today we're going to give you some springtime dressing up ideas. From polka dots to floral patterns, though we've got it all set for you in this episode of Style for now let me begin with this very elegant and feminine green dress. Now, if you notice the neckline of my dress, it's got a thin strap on one side and on the other side, the same strap is covered with leaves. That makes it look very elegant. Now, it is a high-waisted cotton dress. The fabric is very soft and layered, so that gives it a very flowy look. The hemline, which is not so prominent at the bottom, makes it look all the more flowy. Now, any matching footwear would complement a dress like this, black, although it's the safest option. Talking about black, how can you forget the classic black dress? And because it's spring, it has to be different. So how about a dress like this? 2008 is the year for black. This dress has got floral prints all over and a satin border. Now, as far as the jewellery goes, subtle and sweet is so out. It is so bygone. Try to keep the jewellery loud and clear. For this dress, I'm wearing a yellow beaded necklace. And I'm avoiding wearing any other piece of jewellery. Obviously because I want it to be more pronounced. The next dress lined up for today is very retro, very stylish, very stark and very red. As you can see, I'm wearing a short red dress with white polka dots all over. Well, this has got an A-line cut that suits every body type. This spells energy and spunk and to add to it, I'm wearing red footwear. than this and until we see you the next time keep the key to your style safe for more entertaining videos visit other famebox channels click here and subscribe to famebox where web stars shine